Israel's attempt via the Bereshit lunar lander to become the first privately funded spacecraft to land on the moon filled the news cycle back in April. However, the craft's crash landing onto the surface of the moon may have left more than just debris in its wake. It's now thought that potentially thousands of tardigrades, or water bears as they are also known, were spilled onto the moon's surface. These were part of an Arch Mission Foundation project which sent a lunar library inside the Bereshit craft that contained a roughly DVD-sized archive made of thin sheets of nickel and containing 30 million pages of information, human DNA samples, and thousands of tardigrades. According to a report in Wired, Arch Mission Foundation founder Nova Spivak and his advisors have estimated that despite the impact, the library is likely either mostly or wholly intact. The tardigrades, which grow to a length of 0.5 millimeters when fully grown, that were sent to space were dehydrated, mirroring the organism's own ability to enter a dormant state by stopping the metabolic process. Water in their cells is replaced by a protein effectively turning them into glass. Scientists have actually managed to retrieve tardigrades that have spent up to 10 years in this dehydrated state. Now Spivak said there was no danger of these water bears taking over the moon, and if future humans were to find them, they would need to be returned to Earth or somewhere with an atmosphere to reanimate them.